Yo, what's good, YouTube? AJ here. We are back with more Mafia 2 Definitive Edition. I'm going to go ahead and continue on with the story. If you guys haven't checked out the last part, the link to that will be in the description. But yeah, it's been a while I last touched this game. It's been actually a week, though. So I apologize for having uh, not uploading for a while, though. Uh, Alright, we're on to Chapter 12, Sea Gift. Yeah, because I actually forgot where the hell we left off at, though. My house burned to the ground, along with almost every penny I had. There was even some trouble with the cops, but Eddie took care of that. And since I didn't have any insurance, I had to live in this shithole of an apartment till I could get back on my feet. At least I managed to save Leo. He disappeared without a trace. I doubt Frank Vinci even knew where he went. And even though Henry failed to deliver on the contract, Eddie still brought him in when he heard Leo had skipped town. Me and Joe had a new partner. Yeah, so that's all that happened in the last one, which was very fucked up. And there's the phone. And I say answer the phone, not the door. Hey, Vito. It's Henry. Hey. Listen, I'm setting up something big. I want you to come in on it. If you're interested in hearing more, come meet me at Lincoln Park. And bring a piece. Okay. I'll see you there. And bring a piece. Alright. And let's change up. Let's see. You know what? I'm actually gonna go with the tux and bow tie. Let's go with the let's go with the wine red. Hell yeah, looking fresh. Alright. Yeah, we're in Marty's old apartment, which is definitely a shithole. Yeah, that's fucked up our, our freaking house, though. And I love that house. Man, fuck them motherfuckers, man. Please tell me there's a car or something nearby. I doubt there's anything. Definitely, there's definitely nothing. Like, we're all fucked up right now. Well, actually, wait, that's a, that's my car right there. Well, at least it's still there. I mean, you motherfuckers need to move. Yeah, I'll go get this fixed. Said to bring a piece, so I gotta stop by the gun shop anyway. Oh God, look how freaking far he is. Ain't this something? Well, first I want to find a garage. Wait, actually, do I have? Oh, I don't got no money, so I can't go to the garage, and I can't even freaking go buy a gun, so I'm screwed. <sighs> Damn. You said all his money was freaking. In that damn house, though. Yeah, I'm actually trying to be a little careful with the damn driving. It's only worse this car gets more fucked up, and then I gotta freaking deal with the damn cops. And also, I could have sworn that turn was right the next turn. I don't know why it told me a different turn. Yeah, thank you very much. That was actually my fault, but for sure. Shit. Oh, the cop is right there. The car looks a freaking mess, man. This something. Oh, thank God, I'm right here. Oh. oh, 
I shouldn't do that. Again, do I care? Just gonna park it right here. Oh, he's over there. I can still. Can I get over there? Yup, I could. Hey, here he comes. Hey, what's up? Hey, Vito. Take a seat. All right, listen. I've been doing some research at the Carlos business. So? So, the only reason he had Clemente killed was because he was selling dope too. And he was stealing his customers. Now he just needs to get rid of one last obstacle. The one guy who could fuck things up and ruin his plan to become the main supplier for the whole city. <laughs> Frank Vinci. Where'd you get all this? I talked to a few people I trust. Okay. So what does this have to do with us? Cause, if he can do it, why can't we? A kilo of heroin costs 2,500 bucks over in France. Then it's another thousand bucks to get it here. And? And we pick up 11 grand for just driving the stuff to the dealers. That's 7,500 bucks profit a mm. kilo. Yeah, but what about Falcone? Carlo won't find out. And even if he does, he'll just threaten us and demand the cut. All right, but if Carlo's the only big supplier in the city, where are you gonna buy the stuff from? I'm way ahead of you. What do you two know about the Tongs? The Chinks? Some kind of organization for Chinese immigrants, right? That's what I said, the Chinks. Right, but it's also a front for their other operations. They run the Chinese quarter, and they keep to themselves. But some of them are interested in doing business with outsiders, and they need middlemen since most people are afraid to deal with them. And we're the middlemen. Yep. They'll give us 10 kilos to start. For how much? 35 grand. And we can sell it for? 110. Nice. Okay. Well, where the hell are we going to get our hands on 35 grand? I know a loan shark. The Yid over on Palisade. I think a loan is 35 we give him 45 back. Now that means our take is over 20 grand a piece. Not bad for just moving the shit from one place to another. Well, you know, who's going to end up using this crap? What do you care? As long as it isn't an outlet. Because anyway. Vinci was right. Drugs are bad news. They kill people. Look, only idiots do drugs. Deadbeats and losers. If they want to kill themselves so badly, I'd gladly help them out. Especially for 20 grand. I got buyers in the ghetto. They'll take care of the distribution. So we don't need to worry about that. Are you guys in or not? I'm in. Come on, don't be stupid, Vito. 20 fucking grand in one afternoon. Yeah, I'd go for it. When? Right now. If we don't take the offer, the towns will just find somebody else. Come on, Vito, it'll be a piece of cake. Let's go see Bruno then. Vito, how about you run us all down there? He's on Palisade Street. Okay, let's go. Of course, I gotta do the driving in my fucked up car. I need a visit to the Lone Shark in South Park. Alright. Alright, you motherfuckers, come on. Henry, what the fuck are you doing? Ah, these NPCs, man. Oh, this, also, this suit's looking sick, though. Honestly, I would have went with some casual clothing, but <sighs> this you guys know me. I'm all formal. Car won't fit all passengers. Oh, come on. Are you freaking serious? I got to hijack somebody? <sighs> Damn. I was say, where the hell they went? There's gotta be some cars on this side though. Please be. I can't do shit right now. Okay, there's some cars over there. Can that car fill all of them? Yup, it could. Good. This feels smooth. Who's this guy we're gonna see, Henry? His name's Bruno. He's one of the only guys in town who could do a loan this big. What if he doesn't give it to us, then what? Then the deal's off. But don't worry, I know this guy. He'll give us the money. There ain't nobody else we can get this kind of money from? There's three of the guys I know of. But if you want to ask Carlo or Frank Vinci for 35 grand, be my guest. Yeah, no thanks. Who's the third guy? 
He ain't in business no more. Somebody blew up a room full of his guys and shot him point blank in the face with a Tommy gun. Oh, that guy. Come on, we said we wasn't gonna talk about that. All right, so, Henry, what is this guy, rich or something? I think he gets his money from some of the bosses from out of town who sit on the commission. Yeah? No shit. Yeah, which is why we can't stiff the guy. Besides, we gotta keep this quiet. Can we trust him? Sure. Wise guy's been borrowing money from this guy forever. As long as we pay him back on time, we won't have a problem. Oh shit. Hit and run Damn it! <laughs> fucking popped out of nowhere. Oh my gosh. Fuck off, cops. Fuck off. This is a fucking dead end. I thought that was a dead end, man. Oh, they right on my ass. God damn it. Yeah, this seriously just had to happen right now. Actually, I kind of might want to try that one trick. I saw it in a funny moments video. Should I try it? No, I'm gonna try it. I wanna see how this goes. All right, shut the car off and get out of there. This one's gonna cost you six. See, look at that. Your partner just fucking did it. He let me go. <sighs> Even if I don't have no money, thank goodness. But now nah, you should be focused on your partner since he hit your shit. Okay, so you could do the whole apologizing thing, but if I had money, I would have gave him some. But yeah, I saw it in a funny moments video that you actually could pay the cop to just let you go and all like that. Okay, so I gotta remember that next time. But seriously, fuck half these drive all these drivers in this game they just the worst man and there was no way i could have lost them the only thing i would have done was got out the car and left henry and freaking um i would have left them both in the car okay and we was right there too that's what makes it even more fucked up. All right, stop right here, Vito. Okay, so now what? Let's do here. A small ass alley, right? Alleyway. All right, there we go. Hi, fellas. We're here to see Bruno. Hiya, Henry. If you got guns on you, put them down there. I gotta search you. Jeez, I wouldn't have nothing. I got no money. Hiya, Bruno. Hello, Henry. So, to what do I owe the pleasure of your company today? I need 35 grand in $20 bills. Oh, that's a lot of money, Henry. A lot of money. Tell me, why should I give that much to a small-time guy like you, huh? Convince me. I got a short thing. You'll have 45 by the end of the week. What kind of sure thing? Sorry, Bruno. That's a trade secret. 
then 45 is not enough. I'd be more comfortable with 65. That's a bit steep, even for you. 50 is all I can do. Henry, Henry, I have no guarantee I'll get my money back. And you have nowhere else to go. So, how about 60? Don't think of it as interest. It's more like my cut of the profits. 55, final offer. Anything more than that, it's not worth my time. Deal. I'll give you $35,000 today, and you'll give me $55,000 by Friday. If you don't pay it back by then, the debt goes up by $10,000 every week. You'll get it by Friday. Okay. Isaac, prepare $35,000 in $20 bills. Now, you know I trust you, Henry, but if you screw me, remember these wise words from the Bible. And my wrath shall wax hot, and I will kill you with the sword, and your wives shall be widows, and your children fatherless. Exodus, chapter 22, verse 24. <laughs> I'm impressed. You don't seem like the church-going type. Uh, but just remember, the money isn't mine. So even if you get rid of me, that doesn't get rid of your debt. So no funny business, okay, boys? Sure, Bruno. Thank you, Isaac. You want to count it, Henry? I'll take your word for it, and I'll bring it back on Friday along with your cut. I hope so. Good luck, boys. Well, that was interesting. Drive to the Sea Gift Warehouse. All right. Bring your asses on since we're parked way out here. Thankfully, the car is still there. Good. God damn, she got rocked. Sheesh. You could have. I don't, I don't understand NPCs sometimes. Alright. Nice job, Henry. Of course. I told you, give us the dough, didn't I? How come you know the Bible so good, Henry? You read it or something? Bruno always uses the same quote. I go to church on Sunday, so I asked the priest one time. You go to church? <laughs> yeah, and I can understand why you don't. They use big words, there's no hookers, and the fool's lousy. Yeah, that pretty much sums it up. Jeez, I ain't been there since... 45. What? That time your mother made you go to confession? Yeah, that time she smacked me for checking out some chick's cool. Ah, uh, God rest her soul. How about you, Joe? How long's it been? Easter. Ah, oh, that ain't too bad. 1941. I take that back then. You're going straight to hell. What, you just figuring that out now? Don't worry, I'll save seats for the both these. Jeez, you know, I, I haven't gone to church in like, like freaking be years. The same guy. Yeah, what'd you hear? I gotta get well, back, you don't make it a crib, right? What, the guy who cleans the bathrooms at Carlos joint? Yeah, the guy who's only got a finger and a thumb on his left hand. Guess how that happened? I heard he owed a lot of money to some yid from Southport. You get my drift? Oh, right, I get the picture. <laughs> don't worry though. Crab's a moron. Nothing like that's gonna happen to us. Oh man. Honestly, all that church talk makes me really want to go back to church. I just stopped going because of work though. Sheesh, but at this point. Sometimes I'm off, sometimes I'm not on Sundays. So I need to get back. All right, we're almost there. Drive through the gate and into the yard. All right. If you say so. Oh shit, I wasn't even controlling that. I was trying to stop, but it wouldn't stop. Now just follow me. Alright. Hey, we got some business with your boss. Follow me, gentlemen. Mr. Wong is expecting you. Okay, now this stuff. Just kidding. You know what's, and I know this sounds so unexpected, but I just realized 
You know what I feel? I feel who um, killed Vito's father? Why? Do I, I was looking back at my videos. It was, you know, from part one and all. And that fat dude who was just eating while he was working at that warehouse. Why do I feel he has something to do with Vito's father's death? I mean, he did say, y'all gotta die sometime. I, I feel he's the reason for it, though. I don't know. I'm still trying not to spoil ahead of the story. Like I said, I watch, I rewatch these missions after I do them. Welcome, Henry. Hello, Mr. Wang. Let us get straight to business. Is your suitcase heavy enough? See for yourself. Yo, da, this is a of the Earth's million Jin Cao Piao. It's about 35,000 yuan. All right, take it away and bring the goods. You're a good man, Henry. Here is your merchandise. Each bag contains one kilo. Each kilo weighs a little more than two pounds. Which one do you want to test? Well? Okay, we're good. I'm glad. Next time, we can give you twice the amount. It was a pleasure doing business with you, Mr. Wong. The pleasure was all mine. Ah, he ain't the handshake guy. Knock it off. See, the reason <laughs> that was... <laughs> so funny as fuck, man. I like that I deliver these goods. All right, fellas, the hot pot's over. Now we just gotta make the exchange and we're done. Sounds good to me. Where we headed? Hunters. I got it all lined up. Okay, Henry. He, he's, he's doing something, though. Since that last little incident, though. Hello, gentlemen. Fucking I setup. think you have something for us. Drop the suitcases. Aw, oh, shit. Hmm. My shoes. Wait a minute. These guys ain't cops. And how do you expect me to do? I don't got no fucking gun. Oh, I got one. Where the motherfuckers at? Here comes more of Hold on. I got him. Oh shit. That took up a lot of fucking damage. Yeah, no shit, man. Oh, my fucker, don't rush me, alright? This is unexpected. Stay away from these windows, fellas. Oh, I should've kicked- he said kick it, but I just opened it like all regular. the health, fill it up. I won't want to get on your bad side. So you're already on my bad side. Flank of Vito. Jeez, 
This freaking aiming is not easy, man. Oh shit. Fuck. I was trying to hit that guy outside. The hiding spot is so stupid right now. Make the exchange with the Jeez, you can't even Sounds fucking aim Where perfectly. We well, not aim, but like... Up. You can't line it up perfectly to get a shot. That's one thing I dislike about this game. The aiming is horrible. And not only that, you try to fucking hide, you're fucked. Drop the suitcases. Hmm. My shoes. Wait a minute, these guys ain't cops. Kill the bastard! Shoot Vito! Vito, watch our back. Back me up, Vito. Dude, you don't have enough time to freaking defend. Hold on. I got it. Oh shit. Nice. There's still too many of them. Come on. Oh shit, don't go back that way. Run! Yeah, hurry your ass up. Stay away from these windows, fellas. Damn it! Vito, no stay, stay up here. Let's get down there. Vito, kick right. the door in. This time I kick it. Just trying to find the guys. Hey, asshole! Over here! Yeah, alright! Alright, let's go! Let's go! I got you Close covered, Vito! Move! You're fucking dead! I wouldn't want to there get you on go. your bad side. I think supposed to be another guy out there. See if I move over here. Man, shit. Hey, I get my ass killed. Kill, Kill that fuck. This one's mine. Come on, think of something. Hurry up here. I didn't even get him. There we go. Gotta go in between. Alright. Give y'all lessons on how to shoot. Fuck you. Oh shit, there he is. You hide nasal. I'm going in. Time, Vito. Is that the fucking best you got? Oh, you're in trouble. Help me out here, oh, Help me out.
Shoot him! You shooting blanks over there! The truck's in the fucking way. Damn. Again, the whole shooting is ridiculous, man. There's some shit in the fucking way while you're trying to fucking shoot. I hate it so much. Of course you did. Of course you did, bro. Jeez. There's supposed to be one guy right there. You shoot like my sister. Yeah, we know. You said it many times. Nice one. There's a guy over there, too. Yeah, I see him. I'm out, buddy. Got you, bitch. Car won't fit all passengers. I wasn't even gonna go in that ship. Oh, so I got. Oh, I gotta choose one of the cars here. Okay, I see. I see. How the fuck are you expect me to get out, man? Shit. That was fucking close. Oh shit. It's not over yet. They're coming after us. Fuck. Lose them. Yeah. Oh, you alright? What the f Yo! I guess because the car got damaged because I shot at it. But come yo, that was too quick right there. It's not over yet. They're coming after us. Fuck. Lose them. Shit, yeah, I got fucked because of that damn tree. God damn it. It's not over yet. They're coming, They're coming after, after us. us. Yeah, I know. Like I did it. Oh God! Drive to the warehouse uh, and everything. That was see. a red light, you know. So, see. What the fuck was that, Henry? No idea. Somebody else must have known about the deal. Those definitely weren't real cops. Some motherfuckers are Maybe too it was slow. The trying oh, to us. I doubt it. Look, I'll figure it out. But first, we gotta unload this stuff. Vito, take us to the old warehouse and hunters. All right. Hope this deal goes better than the last one. It will. I don't like it going any worse, right? So who are we selling the stuff to? Uh, a bunch of different guys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What do you mean a bunch of different guys? A bunch right? of different guys. What did all that shooting back there make you deaf? I thought you said we were just moving this garbage from one place to another. Yeah, well, you make a lot more money if you sell it in smaller amounts. Would have been really nice to know before I agreed to go in on this. If I did, from the way you were talking back in the park, you probably wouldn't have. 
Yeah, exactly. Hey, oh, the best you go home for right now turn. is to spend the next 30 years of your life breaking your ass for Eddie and Carlo before you either get bumped off or end up back in the camp. The only time you're ever going to see cash like this is if you stick your neck out. Besides, I ever steer you wrong? Well, there was the OPA job. And that time we almost got killed when we whacked that fat fucking sand island. All right, all right, enough. None of that matters after today. Let's just get the hunters. And don't worry, we're never gonna have to see these scumbags again after today. Unless this Liar. turns into a regular thing for us. Well, all right, let's just concentrate on getting through this one before we go making plans like that, all right? Hey, I'm just saying. Vito's right. Let's just get through the rest of the day. After that, smooth sailing, fellas. Say that truck almost got me. Oh shit, that was close. We just made it right here. Here we are. Let me do the talking. These are tough guys, so no wise ass comments. All right, Joe. Hey guys, how you doing? Hey man, come on in. <coughs> Shit! I smoke. Oh, fuck. <coughs> Chasing the dragon, trophy earned. We did it. We hit the jackpot. Hey, hey, hey! Take it easy. We're not done yet. Lighten up, will you, Henry? What's the matter? All of a sudden, money don't make you happy? After we pay back Bruno and you get your cut, then you could be happy. All right, all right. Huh. Oh, montage, huh? That was an ideal. Okay, you know them deals ain't easy. Huh, he's the cops on this. Yeah, the next time. I stop, I get stopped by some cops. I'm definitely gonna have some paper, I hope. I was just about to say, no motherfuckers dead? Shoot. Ooh, got the broads. Shoot, I would have took one of them. Chapter 13, Exit the Dragon. You ain't even gonna give me a tip? Damn. You want a tip? I'll give you a tip. Don't let the door hit you in the ass on the way out. Always the gentleman, huh, Joey? <laughs> Just get the fuck out of here hey, already. Gina, wanna come join me? Hey, I hope there's room for three in there. Ooh. A real action, and we got 500, so at least we got money. But I am actually going to stop it right here. But I am going to give you guys a double. I am going to give you guys um a double upload of Mafia today as a Saturday. So look out for. I'll answer the phone in the next video. But I want to thank you guys for watching this part. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button, look at the comment, subscribe, check out more of the game in the playlist in the description. I'll see you guys in the next video where we can where we. Start off with chapter 13, Exit the Dragon. Peace out, take care, have an awesome day. Stay safe.